Hi guys, how's going? This is the Kitchen Fairy with a recipe for a nice cold uh, sangria because it is summer, it is hot and sunny, it requires cold or chill drink like iced tea or iced coffee but today I'm gonna show you uh, how I make my delish uh, sangria at first I was gonna try uh, a recipe from this book, I won this book um, some years back, long time ago um, on a cooking contest or um, a challenge cooking or recipe challenge or contest um, I haven't tried any of the recipe I thought I'd give it a go but it requires a lot of uh, ingredients that I don't have uh, the one that I'm gonna show you requires only tons of fruits because we really, really like fruits in this house um, and limited uh, or not too many other ingredients but the sangria, it is, is delish. So check out the full video and I'll see you soon again. Bye. We're gonna make the syrup first. This is one cup of sugar with half cup of water. We're just gonna bring it to boil until the syrup totally dissolved. For this, we're gonna have some Okanagan fresh cherries and blueberries and oranges and I think it's pamplemousse and pineapple. So a part of those uh, ingredients that I mentioned earlier I will be also adding um, one lime and one lemon so what I'm gonna do I wash them clean and then I'm gonna slice them and then we're gonna put them in a bowl or in your pitcher for the cherries obviously you want to pit them take out the seed so the cherries two handful my hand Handful. and for the blueberries only one handful and two small uh, two sweet oranges one lime one lemon and two pamplemousse they are all sliced now we're gonna slice the pineapple so you can just the uh, pineapple like so to make it like triangles and add it to the bowl or pitcher now we're gonna squeeze six sweet oranges and add it to the bowl or the, your pitcher now we're gonna pour our red wine now we're gonna pour in our simple syrup as well and we're just gonna give it a little stir and then we're gonna chill it for a couple of hours 